Hello, this is Juventus here. Um, this is a guide of lines 539 to 550 of the Aeneid. Quod genus hoc hominum, quae hunc tam barbara morem permitit patria. So here with our translation, we start with our what here in quote, what race genus are nominative. Um, and then of men, we're going to take this genitive plural hominum. Uh, and then there's going to be an implied est here. Uh, if there's no verb. So uh, what race of men is this? Um, sort of questioning uh, the character of uh, the Carthaginians. Quiet uh, here to introduce our next sentence, or what? Um, the way on the end kind of adds that on. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and take... Uh, our, uh, our Tom here, so our what's so barbarous, so Tom Barbara here, um, a country, uh, patria, which is our subject here, so, or what so barbarous, a country, um, permits, permitted, we'll just take our verb, um, and then this punk custom, form. so in total we have what race of men is this, or what so barbarous, a country permits this custom. Hospitio prohe e bimor harai bella quiant prima que vetant consistere terra. Uh, so here we have uh, we are prohibited right here. Um, and then from welcomes this guy has. Video. This is um, an ablative of separation, so we're going to take it from for this, and then of the sand, our genitive right here. Um, moving on, uh, we have these people, so we're going to go ahead and take Kiant uh, as a day. So these people uh, incite uh, wars, uh, Bella here, um, and then they're going to, and they forbid. Uh, us, sort of an implied us here, to stand consistere. Um, they forbid us to stand on the first part of the land, that is, like, the beach. So essentially what's happening is these people, these Carthaginians, aren't even letting them uh, park on the sand. Uh, see genus who um, humana mortalia temnidis arma ad sperate deos memores fandi anque nefandi. Uh, so here, we're going to start our even if. Let's see, because this ad right here is going to sort of set up an even if. So even if, here, uh, you despise, we're going to take our temnitis, um, which is actually a syncopated form of... Uh, or excuse me, it's uh, a simple form of contemnere. Uh, it's formed by archaism, which is sort of like an outdated form. So even if you are so strong, right here, so even if you are so strong as to fight, human indignation is sort of like a more uh, sort of poetic translation. But really what it's saying is even if... Uh, you despise, or you are as strong too. If, even if you despise the human race, there are two uh, direct objects right here, um, and mortal arms. So even if you despise the human race and mortal arms, that's our uh, first part. Um, at sperate, so at least uh, expect the gods uh, this is sort of setting up an uh, incorrect statement. To at least expect the gods will be mindful um, of the right and the wrong. So the right and the wrong uh, are actually originally gerunds, but uh, they sort of lost their meaning as gerunds uh, over time. All right, so next up, Rex Erat Aeneas Nobis, quo justior alter, nec pietate fuit. Nec bello my art at armis. Uh, so here Aeneas um, was our king. Pretty straightforward. Uh, simple sentence right there. Um, 
and then we're going to sort of take our neck out right here. So neither uh, has anybody been more righteous, so this is just yours as a comparative adjective, um, than whom sort of what it is. So neither has anyone other has anyone been right more righteous than whom, referring back to Aeneas, um, nor greater in piety, nor greater uh, in war, spell it right here, and in arms. Um, so it's sort of implying that Aeneas sort of has your typical traits uh, of a god, um, or excuse me, of a uh, hero uh, in the Aeneid. Quem si virum servant si vescitor aura ithera. So I'm going to stop here for a second. Um, so this is sort of setting up, Ilion is setting up his thing about Aeneas, and, you know, if he's alive. So if fates preserve this man, Quem Wirum, are going to go together. Um, if literally he eats the celestial air, so if he still breathes, essentially. Um, sort of setting up our hypothetical uh, here. Um, ne Nequi ad hoc uh, crudelibus occupat umbris non metus. Um, so, and he does not live, where he does not lie dead in the shadows, uh, have no fear, or it, or literally there is no fear, because this sort of an est implied uh, on the end right here. Uh, so going back here, Westkitor um, is actually Westcourt, which is a puffy verb, uh, which is uh, significant because it actually takes uh, the ablative as a direct object. Um, so back on down here, Ficio nec te cartase priorum poenitiat. Um, so we're going to go ahead and take poenitiat out here because it's actually a justice subjunctive. So we're going to take this first. Uh, so do not be sorry um, to have fought with him. Uh, so it's going to be a cartase because um, that's actually a syncopated form, cartawise. Um, so do not be sorry to have fought and then with him. Uh, it's going to be Arte here um, before, which is our pre arm in kindness of Fikio. Um, so this is sort of uh, setting up, uh, saying, like, don't be guilty that you're helping us. Like, it's okay. Um, so don't be guilty about it. Uh, and then finally, uh, Sunday, uh, Sunday. Siculus regionibus urbes armaque Troian oque a sanguine Laris acestis. So here, uh, so sunt, uh, so there are um, in the regions of Sicily um, cities uh, and arms. So this is sort of saying like they're, you know, in Italy, this is where. Our other people are, um, and illustrious Clarus Acestes um, from the Trojan blood. Uh, so I'm sort of saying, like, if you can't help us, like, we have people in Sicily, we're not here to uh, to conquer your land. Um, and they do have a leader uh, in case this uh, is no longer. All right, thank you very much. Uh, hope you enjoyed today's video, and congratulations, you did it.